here with head women's basketball coach Kara Katwager. Kara, team opened up action in Conference USA against Old Dominion this afternoon. Just your thoughts on tonight's game. Well, I thought we came out and had a great start, which was positive for our team because we've struggled doing that um, a lot this season. We got into some foul trouble, and our bench battled pretty well for most of the first half, and then we kind of lost our composure a little bit. The last couple minutes, we go down five, and I felt like we just didn't really recover. We didn't start the second half with the same balance that we did uh, with the first half. Uh, but we battled back again, and so that is um, the nice thing about this character of our team is that no matter you know what's going on throughout a game, we battle back. But, you know, again, we, we have to learn to play for 40 minutes, which we're just not doing right now. Lefty Webster returns home to Norfolk, where she's from. Ties her career have 21 points. Just almost put the team on her back. Second half, pulled, pulled us back. Large deficit, cut it down to eight at one point. Just your thoughts on her play today? Yeah, I mean she's a special player, and it, uh, I think it hurt us tremendously when she picked up those first those two fouls in the first half, in the first four minutes of the game, and so that really limited our game plan. I mean, she's quickly become our go-to player offensively, and you saw some signs of that here in the second half. But the other thing about her, she just inspires our kids because she plays so hard. And uh, once she came back in the game, in the second half after going out with that injury, um, you know she just she just played well, and our, our kids rallied around her and so um, you know I'm just I'm just ecstatic to have her as part of our team and certainly excited for her to play well in her hometown. Team returns home for two games this week WKU and Marshall I know you haven't looked at them specifically a whole lot at this point but getting back in Halton Arena teams won three in a row in front of Niner Nation just your thoughts about getting back home comforts at home and what that means early in the conference season. Yeah, I mean, it'll be great to have two games at home. There's there's no doubt about that, as we typically do play well at home. But, you know, for us, it's not about who we're playing, and that can't be our focus. We have to get better as a team, and the biggest thing is defensively. You know, this entire season so far, we've just been a very mediocre team on the defensive end. And you saw that again tonight against ODU, a team that came in here not shooting the ball well. We let them shoot 49%, didn't have tough contests, didn't slow down their best player. Um, so until, you know, we, we got to focus on ourselves and we have to focus on learning how to play defensively hard for an entire game regardless of what's happening in, on the offensive end for us. And when we learn to do that, we have an opportunity to be a good team. If we don't, then it's going to be a struggle. All right, Kerry, safe travels back tonight and we'll talk to you again this week before the two games. Thanks.